wow, I'm really, I, whoa. Deep breath, deep breath, deep breath right here for me. Whoa. Okay, I think, let's see, are we on? Hold on here. We are, okay, there we go. Wow, okay, now I am live um, in both places. Hi, everyone. Okay, I'm taking a deep breath because I have some really big news to share with you that I am so excited about. And we honestly have been working on this for a long time. And before we closed, we were ready to kind of go really big with this announcement. And so we took some time and it was so good for us because like you, we've spent the time sheltering at home just to refine ourselves. I mean, the yoga does exactly for us as the studio what it does for you. We all grow and transform. So I'm so excited to share with you that we are growing and changing our studio name. <clears throat> okay, so why are we changing the name? And I have to tell you that honestly, everything I do is inspired by my late mother. Um, and it's really inspired so that people everywhere can live without pain in their body, have joy, and really break free from addictions. And in today's life, there are so many patterns and addictions that creep into our lives, not just like by the traditional what you think of drugs or whatnot. Um, so for me personally, when I began practicing Bikram Yoga, I noticed profound changes in my body like really quickly. I felt it in my emotional well-being, the healing in my heart, in my mind, in my body, in my spirit. And because of that, it became the main foundation of all the, what I didn't know it at the time. I had so much work to do in my body and in my life. And, um, and it became the foundation for that. I knew at that moment, somehow in the midst of where I was at that time in my career, I knew this was magic and I knew that it was gonna be a part of whatever I did and it, I had the opportunity to take this growth and this beautiful healing practice forward. So um, I don't always talk about this, but cause it's kind of funny actually, it was early 2010 that I remember seeing at the studio I was practicing at at the time, I remember seeing a, a flyer for teacher training and I was high, I mean, I was super busy in my career. I had a lot happening. Um, I was totally facing corporate burnout at the time. I had worked so hard right out of college. And I totally had this huge euphoric shift and I took a huge risk not having anything like planned out, but I knew wholeheartedly that I needed to go to teacher training. I didn't know at the time that I would end up owning a studio but I knew that that was a part of my path. So, and sometimes that's how life works. We don't always have the answers. Sometimes I honestly feel like I'm walking with blindfold on and I'm, I'm being guided by a power greater than myself where to go. Sometimes we don't have the direct path, but sometimes we just go and we take turns, we, we keep navigating, and that's the beauty of the journey of life, of everything that we do. Um, so anyways, without further ado, I really want to introduce you to West Coast Sweat, the original hot yoga imas, and more because hot yoga, the original hot yoga, Bikram yoga, is the core of what we do, but we're gonna add in a little bit more here and there. We do it now with Pilates, Inferno Hot Pilates, which is a great compliment to Bikram yoga, but there's so much more on this path of wellness. So I'm gonna see if I can do this without biffing it. Do you, both, do you guys see that? Yay! I hope you're as excited about that as me. Um, I hope you saw that. Now I'm like trying to get these stands back up. Okay, there we go, got it. Yeah, so when you come to the studio, you're gonna see um, the new logo, the new parents, and it fits us so well because at West Coast Sweat, we're a bunch of compassionate yogis and we help people, we help you, we help ourselves, you know, we, wherever you are, heal and grow through the powerful teachings of original hot yoga and more. This is a safe place, it's a sacred place for both you and for me and for us as teachers to practice. We love all students 
because you might not yet love yourself. We let the yoga do the teaching. The yoga is so powerful. We support you and we don't judge you because you might already doing a, be, be doing a really good job of that yourself, right? This is a place, that was one of the first things I noticed when I was practicing, being in front of a mirror, lights on, and being told to only look at myself, right? What goes off in your head? The committee, I, call, I always call it my little committee in my head, right? And so that's so powerful to start to see things that are so amazing about you. Because you, I love it, uh, a woman, I love reading a lot of her books, Marie Forleo, she says it great. The world needs that special gift that only you have. You are so unique, and there are many amazing things about you that are so incredible. And here at the studio, we hope to help you find that. So lastly, for West, at West Coast Sweat here, what we stand for is we love and respect ourselves and others because really we're human. And loving and respecting ourselves and others is the human thing to do. I can't wait to practice with you uh, here at West Coast Sweat and share your excitement. So excited, so much great things happening. So thank you all so much for tuning in. And let me know, leave a comment if you have a question. Um, you know, everything, I, oh, I should make this since I'm here. We just expanded our schedule. So you'll know we put a couple more weeks in July on there. So take a look. But um, again, so many great things happening. We're changing our name, our values haven't, and in fact, we've gotten really clear on why we exist and why we're here to grow alongside with you. We love you and I can't wait to see you and you know, I would give you a hug normally, but for now I'll smile with my eyes and really open my arms for an air hug, yeah? Okay, have a great day everyone and I will see you soon. Thank you, Cindy. I, yeah, I see all the congratulations coming in, I love it. So. Thanks, Abigail. I love it too. I love it. It makes my, my heart so happy. So, whew, I might need to go walk in the corner and give myself a big hug right now. Anyways, all right. I'll see you all soon. <laughs> Yay. Thanks, Leslie.